I don't always stand up for myself, but when I do, it goes a little something like this. Yeah. <laughs> Call me entitled. Call me spoiled. Call me naive. Call me cute. Call me a liar. Call me two-faced and a shrew. You'll be delighted to find I have many more faces than two. <laughs> Call me careless, reckless, worthless, thankless, helpless, hopeless, shameless. Call me stupid. Call me sick. Call me lame. Call me non-compliant and defiant and insane. Call me frail. Call me fragile. Call me brittle. Call me fake. Careful now, I might be so brittle I could break. <laughs> Call me crazy. <laughs> Call me weird. Call me a geek. Call me cruel. Call me lazy. Call me dirty. Call me a freak. <laughs> Call me childish. But I'm rubber and you are glue. Whatever you say about stuff means sticks to you. <laughs> Call me a hag and I'll turn you into a toad. Call me a poser and... You can call me a bitch, and I could show you one. Call me codependent, but only if you say I am. Call me a few cards short of a deck, not the brightest crayon in the box, and a few clowns short of a circus. <laughs> call me up, call me out, call me back, call me in. Call me on the carpet and down on my knees, because no one wants a fellow with a social disease. <laughs> Put me in a box and tie me in a bow. It's easier just to play along, don't you know? I've spent my whole life trying to be all these labels you've assigned to me. When words became like weapons in the looking glass, I'd hide. But powerless becomes empowered on the other side. Though our gardens may look different, our soil is worth the same. What's that about a rose that's called by any other name? If you don't like these metaphors, you can write your own. I'll answer to the name I'm called when my creator calls me home. <laughs>